Michael here with, with another Michael's Guitar Reviews. Today we have a vintage all mahogany guitar. Now, first of all, vintage in this case does not necessarily relate to the age of the guitar. It's the make. It's called vintage. This is the V300MH model, MH being mahogany. It's mahogany back and sides and mahogany front. Uh, vintage guitars are distributed in the United Kingdom and uh, overall they're actually not expensive but generally quite good quality. No idea where they're made, there's nothing in the label to tell us. I can only make a guess and say it's somewhere in the Far East because the quality is generally quite good and the price is generally quite inexpensive. Anyway, let's have a little look, shall we? Normal headstock, very, very no fuss, no frills, square across the top, three tuners either side, and those tuners are enclosed. The neck itself is a nice, comfortable, satin-finished C profile. It's very comfortable indeed, and it's mahogany. The fingerboard with normal dot position markers looks to be rosewood. However, depending on the day, the date of its manufacture will determine whether or not it's rosewood. You're probably aware that there was an embargo on rosewood for a while. Um, I mean, it does look like rosewood, but I, I cannot stick my neck out and say that it is. Uh, the, bo the body itself is no frills. It's a very, what you might call a studio type um, design in that there are no bindings or anything to make it look a bit blingy or flashy. The only thing that it has is this rosette, which looks to be, potentially looks to be like a transfer. But it's nice, it's very nice. It's kind of herringbone design, which always looks good. The nut looks like it's bone, but it's not. I'm sure it's not. I'm sure it's one of those very clever um, facsimiles of bone, but it's been cut properly been cut accurately, it's finished well, and the strings sit just comfortably, just slightly proud of the nut, as they should. The uh, bridge saddle is compensated, which is great because it means the intonation is going to be that bit better. This particular guitar has just been fitted freshly with a set of 11 gauge strings. The only thing I would say about this is, it's got one strap button there, and I can't find another one anywhere. Which means you've got a choice of either putting some string around the top, which I always feel a little bit, you know, not very good, to be honest. Um, better still, get yourself a strap button for a very little amount of money, and either fit it yourself or have it fitted to the bottom of the heel or the side of the heel. It'll be there forever, it will work well forever, never need maintaining, and it means your guitar is going to sit comfortably on the strap. So, mahogany top, mahogany back and sides. It's probably about a triple O type size for those of you who are familiar with things like Martin guitars. Um, and it feels nice. What does it sound like? Let's have a listen. We'll start with a bit of plectrum, shall we? Here we go. Now it does sustain quite well. It rings out quite well. It's got a nice, it's got a nice sort of nutty flavour to it. That makes sense. Quite resonant, quite boomy. Of course, this one is the non-electric version. This is all acoustic, so we're stuck with just what we've got. Let's try it with a little bit of finger picking and see what you think to the difference in the tonal quality overall.
what's the verdict? For not a lot of money, you get a lot of guitar. I think it would uh, definitely benefit from having a pickup fitted so that if you want to go out and play live, then you've got a little bit of uh, an additional resource, if you like. I know that you can put a microphone before it and it probably sounds very nice. Um, but as it is at the moment, a uh, lovely little guitar. So again, this is Michael at Michael's Guitar Reviews. Um, I might have asked in one of my other videos whether you might consider liking and subscribing because it helps to get this channel out there to more people. More people can share the love of these lovely instruments. Well, here it goes again. Please like and subscribe. Anyway, thank you for watching. Happy playing. Hope to see you again. And check out some of the other videos. There are loads of them out there now. And thank you very much for watching. Bye for now. <laughs>